Another way to change material is to right click on the part and then select Eye Properties. Let's go to the Physical tab. Under Material, we can use, let's say, ABS Plastic. And let's click Apply and Close. Now let's mention a few words about working with favorites. Let's select it from the materials menu. We've only got three materials, ABS plastic, aluminum, and generic. So those are the three that I've used so far in this document. Let's right click on our part and go to eye properties, physical tab. Under material, we have the same three materials, ABS plastic, aluminum, and generic. Let's close this window and launch the material browser. Here's the material browser, and you'll be spending a lot of time here. Here we have the Autodesk material library, and below it is the Inventor material library. Up top, marked with a star, are my favorites. We can expand and browse the subcategories as well. If your browser looks different, you can change its appearance using this drop down menu. Let's return to a thumbnail view. We can also change the thumbnail size at the bottom of this menu. Here's 24 by 24 pixels. Let's restore 64 pixels. All right, let's select and manipulate a material. I've selected metals, and I'm going to grab copper and drag it right up to the top pane. When I mouse over each of these thumbnails, I get a preview of what it'll look like in the graphic area.